Hello and Assalamualaikum Today I would like to discuss and explain to you about our mini project entitled Production of Benzene to Toluene Hydro Deactivation So our group consists of 5 members which is Zakwan, Shazwan, Rizwan, myself, Aiman and also Jamal So I would like to describe about benzene further So benzene is an important chemical compound consists of 6 carbon, 6 hydrogen It is composed of 6 Six carbon attached with a ring and with one hydrogen atom. So benzene uh, properties of benzene are they are colorless, uh, highly flammable, volatile. Mostly benzene can be found in the production of crude oil. So uh, production of benzene can be made from three reactions with catalyst reforming, toluene hydro deactivation, stream cracking. So for this mini project, uh, benzene will react with hydrogen and will produce uh, sorry. So for this mini project, uh, Tolvi will react with hydrogen and will produce benzene and also methane. So for further discussion, I will pass to my friends. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Ahmad Zakwan Miroslan. Today I will present about the overall mass transfer uh, material balance about the Tolvi hydro dealkination. So you say uh, for our diagram for the overall of uh, our process and next slide. Okay, this um, process for the reactive process, which is um, the process we are injected uh, hydrogen 301 kilomol per hour, and for the toluene we inject about 108.7 kilomol per hour. So about this program. The, com uh, the conversion of this program of toluene is just consume 90% uh, of the toluene. So, for the output, for the reactor, for the toluene, so 10% from the toluene input will be, will be the output. So, toluene must be 10.87% kilomol per hour so next so this is for the non-reactive process which is for the separator distillation for the boost distillation so we just use for the same flow rates because it's just non-reactive process so for the separation can we can see that um, here, separation. We want to separate the product from the reactor, which is hydrogen. We don't want the hydrogen, so we recycle hydrogen from the process to the fresh input. So, as a bottom product, we can have a, a methane, benzene, and toluene. So. For the next stage is distillation. So distillation, we want to distillate and we want to um, purify that um, our product, our main product, which is benzene and methane. So to separate the toluene from the top product from the separator, so we use the distillation to separate the toluene. And we can see that toluene also being the re, uh, go to the recycle process because we want to use recycle uh, toluene back. So we go to the, the next distillation, which is the top product is methane, and for the bottom product is benzene. So as we know, we want to produce the product of methane and benzene. So, I would like to pass my presentation to my partner. Thank you. Assalamualaikum and hi. My, na my name is uh, Aiman. Now, I will continue uh, from Zakwan to explain about application of benzene. Actually, uh, in the world, we use uh, benzene 
uh, mostly in daily life or chemical or manufacturing chemical. Okay, uh, today I will explain four, uh, only four points about application of benzene. Okay, first of all, uh, first point is laboratory chemical. Okay, uh, in laboratory chemical, as we know, uh, we use benzene in uh, uh, we use we use benzene for study. For any experiment, we we use benzene. Then uh, next point is uh, we use in uh, any any lab uh, in production of any product related to the benzene. Okay, the second point is pharmaceutical. Uh, as you know, uh, a lot of medicine medicine in this world use the benzene to uh, product to produce uh, any medicine to <coughs> any medicine. Uh, but uh, it used in uh, little in limited uh, limited amount in the medicine because it uh, because it will uh, give side effect for uh, our body such as uh, leukemia uh, the third point is pesticide uh, benzene used in the uh, pesticide pesticide that uh, we use to kill any pest or rat or any insect in our daily life okay next uh, we move to uh, uh, to the last point about application of benzene uh, is food stain or food stain and vanish actually uh, we can see it we can see uh, at our home or any place uh, like the like wood though we use uh, the vanish to make uh, the uh, the look shine okay uh, actually the the look shine because of we use the benzene in the vanish and the wood stain okay we proceed to the next Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi, my name is Jabal Fitri. Now I will proceed our presentation. Uh, my part is the factor that enhances the production rate of the process. First, the point is temperature and kinetic energy. As increasing the temperature of a system, increase the average kinetic energy of its constituent particles. As the average kinetic energy increases, the particle move faster and collides more frequently for unit time and possess greater energy when it's when they are collided. Most of these factors increase the rate of reaction and most of the factors are uh, is used commonly in uh, other reactions. The next factor is the distillation column design. Good distillation design lead to the highest efficiency. The best type of the tray should be used is sieve tray this is because they are lighter weight and less expensive compared to others sieve tray is easier and cheap to install the pressure drop the pressure drop of sieve tray is also lower compared to others next factor is use benzoic acid instead of toluene benzene also can be produced by the reaction benzoic acid in subcritical water using a copper one oxide catalyst. Why we use the copper one oxide catalyst? Because it is more environmentally friendly, efficient, efficient, and economical. And the catalyst used was an effective and a stable catalyst. So we will, my friend, we will continue about our finding and our conclusions. Assalamualaikum, my name is Muhammad Shazwan. Let's me continue our presentation and our last step for this presentation for our mini project. As a conclusion, benzene can be produced based on reaction of two living hydrogen under certain conditions. Distillation column and separation was used to help this production as shown in the FB diagram in our previous slide. Other than this method of production, there are a few other methods to produce benzene such as such as catalytic reforming and steam cracking. 
this type of method are must have their own condition. Added use in an industry, um, benzene also used in laboratory chemical as a study, pharmaceutical, plasticide, and wood stain and varnish to produce the best quality or enhance the or enhance the production of benzene. There are three ways such as the design of the distillation column, the temperature and kinetic energy, and the presence of catalyst. All these recommendations have is economically, economic, economical, safe, low cost of maintenance, and eco-friendly. That's all for our presentation for this mini project. I hope you all enjoy watching this video.